Okay, good job, mate. Really, really well done. That was a fantastic drive. Bring it home. With qualifying finished, it's time to remind ourselves once again of our top three. Surfer Girl, Sainz and George Russell. Goodbye for now then, but really we're just getting started. Make sure to join us again for Lights Out tomorrow. Welcome to Budapest once again for another round of Formula One action. Historically, a good race for first-time victories, with Button, Hill, Alonso and Heike Kovalainen all reaching the top step of the podium for the very first time right here. 14 corners then for our drivers to navigate at the 2.7 mile Hungaro rink today. It's six lefts and eight rights around a lap here with average speeds in the region of 120 miles per hour. It's time to see how our drivers are stacking up after yesterday's exciting qualifying session. Surfer Girl lines up on pole position and the smooth operator Carlos Sainz completes the front row. As we continue through the rest of the grid today, we have Russell, Hamilton, Leclerc, Mayer, Albon, Perez, Norris, Verstappen, Stroll, Oscar Piastri, Bottas, Sonoda, Liam Lawson, Joe, Magnussen, Hulkenberg, Ocon, Gasly, Sargent, and Nick de Vries. It's almost time for those five red lights to go out then. Let's see who can prevail today. It's race day yet again, and joining me for a chat is Natalie Pinkham. Now our racers are certainly in for a rough day today. What will you be watching for as they go down into turn one? There has been an exponential growth in the popularity of Formula One, and it is fantastic to see. This is the glue that's bonding families together. This is the talking point on a Sunday afternoon as they sit round and watch the race as a unit. I love the fact that people are starting to appreciate the various nuances of the sport, the fact there are so many layers to it. This is the cutting edge of technology, but there's also so much personality and sacrifice, personal sacrifice, that gets drivers and race teams where they are today. So the formation lap is underway here in Hungary. The front runners will want to get themselves prepared for the race ahead as they can expect to be attacked through the first two corners when the lights go out. And they'll need to survive those in order to kickstart what they hope is a promising race. As the cars make their way back to the starting grid to form up and get ready for lights out, Let's hope the race ahead today is a thrilling one that will go down as a memorable Grand Prix in the history books. somewhere on the MG UK. To manage this, we're going to need to lower our ERS deployment mode. They're all fresh softs. They're currently sixth.
to overtake Button more, it's time to utilize some of this energy. Come on. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 3.2 seconds. They're on fresh softs. They're currently sixth. And the time last lap was a 1.29.6. Okay, DRS will be enabled this lap. You can use it when you're within one second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone. with them. They might make a mistake and we could still regain the position. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 2.3 seconds. Okay, Cali behind, Cali behind. Okay, car behind trailing us, 1.9 seconds. They're on fresh softs. Their tyres are three laps old. We think they've got one more stop. The last lap time was a 1 minute 24.4.
Use Overtake, use Overtake. behind you now, less than a second separates you. Okay, they're on old softs. Their tires are eight laps old. We think they've got one more stop. The car behind has front wing damage. It will have a harder time keeping up with you, so keep pushing. And the time last lap was a one minute, 25.3. Push, push, gap to the car behind. 3.2 seconds. 
All right, we'll be doing one more stop today. One stop left in this strategy. Your pit window opens in five laps time. Five laps. No rain expected for the time being. Okay, dry seem like the best tyre for now. Just focus on the driving. Okay, one stop to go. Just one stop left in this strategy. And your pit window opens in two laps time.
okay, we want you to pit this lap, so push now, push. Okay, off we go, back into the race. Perfect job on the turn in there, mate. Looks like a nice stop time. We're happy with that one. Pit strategy complete. See these tyres through to the end now. We're currently trailing our teammate by 0.7 seconds. Okay, they're on old softs. They're in second. And the time last lap was a 125.3. Hamilton ahead. Okay, gap ahead is 1.8 seconds. Okay, they're on old songs. Their tyres are six laps old. We think they've got one more stop. The last lap time was a 1 minute 23.8. Okay, Callie's in the pits. Callie's in the pits now. The car behind's just boxed the mediums. The car behind on the medium tyre now. seconds. Right, we need to get past here. Use overtake, use overtake. Tires, manage your tires.
22 laps of fuel remaining. No threat of rain for the time being, conditions look good. Dry's definitely seem like the fastest tyre at the moment.
got a lot of spare energy, OK to use your overtake button. OK, so we're leaving our teammate by 5.3 seconds. start falling away soon. <laughs> Callie's behind you. Okay, the gap is less than a second. They're on old mediums. And the time last lap was a 1 minute 24.8. That's Russell just ahead. Push for the position. They're on old mediums. Your last lap time was a 125.4. Okay, you've got P3, P3, well done. They're on old mediums. Leclerc behind. And the gap behind us is 3.2 seconds. They're on old mediums. Look after these tyres now. We want to finish the race on this compound. Okay, just five laps until the end.
now. They're on old mediums. Okay, they've done 15 laps on those tyres. Time last lap was a 1 minute 24.7. Come on, mate, we're dropping back by a second a lap. lap is a 121.6. Sorry, we can't provide you with that information right now. with five laps of fuel remaining, five laps of fuel left. Okay, no issues with tyre wear for now. Keep taking care of them. Take now, come on, push hard. Russell's ahead of you now. Our gap to the car in front is 2.3 seconds. They're on old mediums. Their tyres are 17 laps old, and the time last lap was a 1 minute 24.6. Okay, so you're gaining by around 6 tenths a lap. And we're going to be leading the championship.
superb driving. That is the race win, my friend. Well done. So after a day of mixed fortunes up and down the field, we bring today's race to a close. So Natalie, what do you think helped them deliver this result? I want to know if that was as easy as it looked. An absolute masterclass today. Well, what a thrilling end to an incredible Grand Prix weekend. Our top three finishers should be incredibly happy with what they were able to achieve out there today. After this round of the World Championship, here's how things look in the driver's table. Surfer Girl increases their championship lead. So then, Natalie Pinkham, who would you rank as your driver of the day? I have to give it to Surfer Girl. It's time to check out the constructors' standings. The owner driver's team moved to the top of the table. After an event like that, who knows what the sport has in store for us next time out. Be sure to join us once again as we continue to bring you all the excitement of Formula One.